I recently bought this uh, Synology Disk Station DS224 Plus. So obviously I needed uh, two disks. Uh, this is a two bay one. And so I bought two 10 terabyte hard drives from eBay. These are refurbished, but the reviews are pretty good. It's from a seller called Go Hard Drive. And each 10 terabyte hard drive cost me $70. So bought the two hard drives from this company. They also uh, have their own website, I believe. Uh, Go hard, hard Drive. And it comes with a five-year warranty. I asked the seller before I made the purchase to make sure. Uh, but I do want to test this. Let's take them out. Pretty well packaged. Oh, they've got a SATA extension for each hard drive. That's nice. So these are the Helio Seal architecture, the HE10 series drives. Um, the listing didn't accurately list the cache. I believe the cache is 256 megabytes. Listing was uh, in one place, 64 in another place, 128 megabytes. All right, so to test those out, I'm going to use uh, this Unitech um, hard drive dock. Um, and also to be able to record it on the screen, I recently got a capture card. Uh, it's the Easy Recorder 330 from Aver Media. It's not the best. But probably not the worst either. Uh, it actually supports recording without a PC. You can record to a USB drive or SD card. And I plan on using this uh, Logitech H151. Um, uh, you know, cheap mic. Let's see how it turns out. Okay, so I have both hard drives mounted on the dock. Uh, let's look at the first one. Uh, power on count 42, power on hours 48,166 hours. Wow. Um, reader rate is zero. Current helium level is 100, so that's good. Uh, doesn't look like any bad sectors, but I haven't formatted it yet. So besides Crystal Disk Mark, I'm using another uh, software. It's uh, the G Smart Control. That one is detecting an error uh, on one of the drives. It's um, doing smart offline or self-test. Identity not found. Honestly, I have no idea what this means, but I will probably reach out to the seller with this. Uh, there is option to do a self-test, and the self-test is completed without any error. So. Should I be worried? Mm. If you know more about this, uh, please do let me know in the comments. One thing uh, good is uh, I've read reviews where the smart data was uh, reset. So neither of these two drives that I got uh, had smart data reset. So that's good. This one is a little less, uh, 26,885 hours. Error rate is zero. These are all zero. Uh, looks good.
let me format them and we'll do a speed test. All right, let's do a speed test on the first disk. So first disk uh, test completed. The results are um, as expected. Let's run the same test on the second drive. No surprises with the second drive uh, with the crystal disk mark. Uh, similar results. All right, so I am going to put them in my NAS and um, hopefully no major issues. Well, the vendor said five year warranty and I'm not putting, you know, critical data in the, on there anyway. Now let's uh, see how my capture card video turned out. Thanks for watching.